everybody, Heroes of the Greek series, part number 13, I think, of the series. Again, thank you for joining me here today. I think it's been a week since we last played it, and a lot has happened. As you can see, we, I mopped up the uh, uh, the things. Um, we are fields of where we left off, and now we're going to uh, finalize the recruitment of this army that is going to help us uh, try and push over here. But we are going to re recruit um, a new settlement that will try and... Um, yeah, expand actually our way into the uh, our homeland, I suppose, our origins from the Islamic world. So that's one thing that we want to go and do. Um, we might also run take Saragossa back. We have taken Pampola, but Pampola is basically a menace of a settlement. That is um, basically an unhappy settlement that doesn't really want to play nice. <laughs> that's well, basically the summer up, I would say you can give it. Um, we have been building up our economy as well as again upgrading this. So right now we're 16 turns and this one is done. Um, we are already far lower than it was. Like I think we have definitely decreased it. I think we are now at like under than two, uh, 210 percent, and we are upgrading even more of those buildings that will help us out with our uh, uh, faction-wide uh, uh, resource rate. A couple, so we're still going to try and upgrade those. Um, yeah, just the wars right now just are really like annoying. And for here, I've got two faction settlements, two armies that take control of the uh, of the settlements basically. Uh, that's happening over here. Pampola is going to still re uh, remain re defended. I'm going to hope. I'm going to like put him into an ambush. My actually, I'm going to. Um, I lost my general. Actually, I think I lost one of my generals. Um, to a freaking assassin, but is annoying. And we're also seeing a freaking priest over here that we have to go and get killed because I'm pretty sure he's already like um, bringing it down. It's not great. So yeah, we got nine here, so that's still not enough. <laughs> if we get this, we got twelve, so that's not too bad. But that's definitely something for the later stage. Although it's like these young things mostly toss only 10 turns so that some of it could go for at some point but I think might not be bad but I would love to have my economy a little bit better before I do that to be honest um here we are almost done with that one so there's another 10 percent uh, here nothing really happened these problems are now finally you know case stage if you can like hold off on them to be honest so that's quite nice to see I would love to have like another uh, upgrade in my own power uh, what I mean by that is basically get like one more uh, buff so I can recruit some more uh, um, yeah, priests if possible. Flanchia is like still being converted over, that's great. Uh, and that's basically only because of our uh, character with his 33%. What is still uh, is not high uh, in that region. So we're actually, actually like 1%, not even 1%, 1%. Uh, 0.1%. I'm thinking I'm going to send him here. Like actually just take a look how like, much that changes it. Like by two, but I think this one wouldn't it would help a lot if we uh, can push this one up a little bit for now. Um, this will get very close very soon. Like again, like six, and this one is just six or six, so 50 50 this will be in total. Um, that's I think how that works. So you can play with that a little bit. Um, but yeah, Bracker is still in a uh, not happy position, but not taxing it because basically it. Yeah, it will give us some money actually right now, so like a little bit of extra 600, but for now I'm just not taxing them. Um, uh, like this one is, st is like still 15, so I think I'm going to tax this because like also it's a thousand. Every volume is okay, but then we of course have uh, uh, that one. I'm actually already taxing it. I'm actually not going to tax this one because that is a little bit better in the public order standpoint. Uh, we're going to upgrade this guy. Who is one of our commanders who is basically the leader of that? Um, he is here to control these two provinces. Yeah, I don't need to know what to do with Leon to be honest. Leon is basically. Oh, it's been a not a great settlement to creep. It has a little bit of money, I suppose, but that's it, I would say. Um, these guys have been taking out uh, his annoyances. Uh, I will try and attack actually. Uh, I, what? I, I put you in an ambush stench. Ah, of course. Yeah, that's smart. Uh, 
I will put him into an ambush stage and then we'll let him attack. Hopefully that will work. I don't know. But uh, let's just enter and see what happens. Well, here we go. We have a uh, rebellion in Pumple Ola and it actually took it. Damn it. Ah, well, that was happening. Um, well, we are lucky we have peace with England. But it's a really, really nice because right now I can, I can focus on Papa Ola and just hold that for the moment. And then we can push towards Montrepolet, Marseille and Vene. I think that is possibly like this area is what I possibly like, at least Marseille and Montrepolet, like a sort of a staying ground and from there on we have to go and see. But having peace with England is, that definitely helps us out a lot. Maybe France is interested, no, low. But it's good that we like uh, push the England into submission. Oh, look at that. <clears throat> There's another piece that I wouldn't mind. And we're also gonna get some good uh, cash for it because they uh, feel like they have been absolutely defeated. Okay, thank you. Oh, oh, like, like I think there's like a dress mark how much money they have, and then like the right now it's high, but I can't give any more than that because then they're like out of money, I suppose. That's basically what happened there. So that's not bad for us. So there's another piece. Uh, the void we're also war with, and I think we'll have like the same thing. Oh, they are. You know what? I'm not going to pay for that. I'm going to see what we can do with that. Uh, Pisa is actually taking back Satinia, or did they already have that? I'm not sure. Um, Papal states were still war. We're not actually the war with, so that's fine. Uh huh. Who are also the war with? A lot of people, basically. <laughs> we, we defeated you guys, but I don't think you're interested. Duchy of Lorraine? Maybe? Nope. Electra of Tyria, I already asked you guys now think of it. Um, Provenisa, you know, I wouldn't really want to trade, but it's unfortunate to be honest. I would love to like trade more, it would give me some extra money. Um, relatively good attitude. Like, we offer a li little bit of um, a reasonable attitude, but not really anyone who wants to trade with us or can trade with us, which is unfortunate, but um. Let's go for treaties with war, Navarra, yeah, okay, that won't work. I've tried that with them before. Welcome no. Alright, so that's only the only piece that we could acquire, but still nice to have that little bit of extra cash. Uh, he's like done in a turn, so that's great. So, now I have possibly have to go and take Toulouse. Um, could we never take it to like with one army? Is that possible? Um, we have done it before, and I think the army of the king is definitely can do that. I would say he has the men for it. All right, let's do that then, and uh, we'll let the army of the can be in ambush, and we'll attack um, look, this city for now. I think over this way, we also will assassinate whoever that is. I don't mind. I'm actually going to send you over. Here to see if you can kill off that priest, which you can. So this also will be, um, yeah, we'll send the king over here to ambush, and we'll put uh, him into an attack on the city. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. All right, uh, occupation. Yeah, let's do that. All right, I'm just going to repair everything. I think we will destroy that, and we'll build like a mosque or something like that. That would be bad. We have to start converting. And I think we also have like an extra port over here, so we're definitely going to build that here too. Just at least to have some sort of a less public order bonus because that's killing me over here. Like it is basically only that. That's the only thing that really bugs me in the provinces. Like basically unrich uh, differences, just the only thing that does it. Over here we have a rebellion in a turn, doesn't matter too much. We'll upgrade this to get a little bit more food. Over here we're okay, and uh, yeah, not on the, like 81 turns, and then we have a really good unit upgrade. I'm curious to see how much the upgrades will be, because I would love to have some better armored units that can more tank stuff, and that will help us out in the long run, I would say. Uh, let's get one more of those guys. Um, I'm not sure, I don't think we can recruit. Can we recruit in our territory? I think if we upgrade this, we can. And having some, I don't know, having some stuff will help out. Alright, over here is basically like an, um, 
one on one battle but still these ones are still not taken so that's fine uh, it seems like we have got some Venice I'm really interested like that listen Venice really has invaded over here so that's quite cool and Georgia is also strong King of Georgia has taken a lot of territory Alania why are you not like a freaking Christian kingdom that's annoying or uh, an Islamic kingdom why are you the Kachnid of Bolfolhor I like that quite good with us they actually have some decent treaties but I just don't think they are that strong. They only have like this one, so that's unfortunate. Unfortunately, the down ground touch of Kiev can't really do much with us or wants to. Um, we're just going to see if what we can also find. I think over here we are uh, the Emperor of Trebizond. That is, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, that's the Emperor of Trebizond, but basically unhappy because of. Um, yeah, mainly because of great power. Also, I see a cultural and a religion, so a hate rival empire, so it definitely makes a little bit of sense. Like, great power, oh my god. Not a lot. Oh well. I can't really see that good. Yeah, that's not right. Um, we also have like a spy over here. Um, it's going to. Oh, he has been um, annoyed, it seems. <laughs> oh well, doesn't matter too much. Uh, this army is definitely strong enough to like to take on most of the rebels that will come along. But a rural recruit though, I like two cavalry units to go along with this army, so it is a little bit of a little bit has a little bit of extra strength. And in two turns there won't be any rebelling step from here, but these guys will deal with that I would say. That's fine, so that's okay. And over here we're done in a turn. And then we can move towards here. Alright then. Um this is it, let's end turn. We have um Murat, oh well, we have some annoyances, of course. We have lost uh, one of our generals in. Oh, wait a second, that's over here. Oh, no, really? Oh, does this guy is dying all the time? I was not sure who it was, but it seems to be him. Yeah, I can't really do anything against that. Um, I get uh, annoyed by that pot. This, uh, I'm doing totally the same thing to them, so yeah, I can't really complain, can I? <laughs> Um, but uh, we're going to uh, kill with them off now. I will assassinate it. Mm -hmm. Go, go. Go, you Christian monk. Go, go, go. Alright, we're done in a turn, and in a turn we'll also rebellion. I think we can, like, go and hold it for a turn, but I rather just wouldn't. Just finish them off, if I can. What's the thing? I think the better option. Oh god, I again did remove the mouse sound, thank you. That's always great, right? When it happens. Yeah, that's, it is a nice, really good headset, I would say. It is nice for sound of oh, my ears, it's, it's nice, but uh, the only thing I don't like is how easily the uh, sound button is um, able to move around. Ah, <laughs> uh, but well, that's okay. Well, actually, over here, not bad, like min one, so that's great. Um, actually. I think one more would help out. Mm. Uh, do we have the food for that? Or don't we? We don't. Um, I think what I will do though is actually I will... Jesus. Really? Current temptation so much. I will remove this one. Uh, I don't want to get one. I will put there a mosque instead. Alright. That's fine. And we'll increase this mosque again. Yeah, there's all our money going again. Um, but I think what we'll have to do is just march on Toulouse and um, and Montreuil, who we can not attack. Ooh, thing is, I'm a bit scared that they have like a lot, like a lot of units. Hello. Okay, that's not good. We have some. Um, Imperial, no, not Imperial, but why Imperial? I could move out, I suppose. Some you could do for the moment. I'll move out a year, but look at that, like, still min 9. Like, who? 15! I must say, the addiction differences in this game are such a pain. Like, a lot of, a lot of pain. Oh, so much. Isn't nice. <laughs> that is just not great at all. 
Um, I will put him over here and see if he can take up one of these ones. Um, he has a good army to be honest, but he has a lot of calves, so... I'm just curious to see where they are going. Um, could, they, they could just take Algorays, although no, I possibly could hold that. Uh, Vez is also quite well defended. Yeah, decent enough. Mercurea is also... They are all well defended. They possibly could hold it. But uh, I will pull back. I'm fine with it. If French attacks, they can attack. attack. Actually, what we're going to do, we're not going to go over here, we're just going to attack as our goes. Damn it! Oh my god. Attack them or don't? Like, really? Are you kidding me? What? Why did they, like, not attack? They could have attacked him. It's good for me because I will be able to take it afterwards. Um. So, yeah. I'm definitely going to do this because that means this guy won't reinforce it. Uh, and I will just go and set over here in the forest in also an ambush position. Um, Alright, we're going to send you back. Oh no, you already did uh, some stuff with your uh, ch companion. Or did they they killed my champion off, didn't they? Yeah, they did. Damn it. Um, I can check it if we can recruit stuff over here. Um, if he's dead or not, I hope not, because he was a really good one. Oh, thank god he wasn't. Nice, he wasn't killed off. Um, we have still some stuff to see, I don't know, like, uh, there's not much else that we can go for, except for go down here and see if we can maybe find the Latin Empire, if they are willing to trade, I don't know. It is always nice to see if we have, can find some trade partners, but most of the, um, yeah, we don't really have any trade partners, like, the only guys we have to trade with are the, uh, yeah, only four, like, only four. There's not much. There is not much. <laughs> I can't say that. That isn't much. Uh, Constantinople. No location. Ah, you find it in Latin, so. Who knows? Who knows what happens with that? But. Um, I didn't. I really hope. I really hope you don't rebel. Because you've been doing that like the entire time. All right then, let's just end turn. Um, there's not much that we can do at the moment. There's just me waiting around, hoping that I can kill off this faction. And then, uh, yeah, these guys. I think I've removed these guys because they're just not good for an um, army for this. Because they're not, they're, they're too expensive, and these guys will handle rebellions more than good enough. And I'll remove like one of these guys and I think is fine again yeah it also saves me money so let's do that and nice these ones are also built in a turn this one's built up too in Seville Seville yeah, all places still not all right that's just nice why are you unhappy taxes religion so I think if we would build this one up or build uh, I think a temple wouldn't be bad here to be honest um, so we might do that. Uh, this one is almost ready. I will sing almost, not at all. Um, town barracks. Could go and get those ones instead. Militia quarters. Yeah, someone was saying that instead of getting these ones, um, getting the uh, town barracks instead. What is actually, actually smart, because I'm pretty sure the, uh, um, these guys, they actually have the same stats, I'm pretty sure, they also have like public order building bonuses, but it, these ones I can recruit something, this, this one I can't. Oh no, this, they are the same. Oh, whoops. Well, that's my mistake. I made a mistake there, I said nothing. Alright, that was, uh, nothing to be said with that. Um, uh, if it's, if it's something else, let me know, but, uh, yeah. Right now, I'm just trying to make sure that I can take Toulouse and then we'll try and take Montpellier and maybe get like a piece with France and I can finally focus on the economy because that is a thing that I want to go and do a long time. Just focus on the economy and send some armies over here to a war front that I can just easily play with, not really have to worry about my own corp territories. Uh, that's basically what I want to go and do, so that is actually not too bad to send these guys over here. So, what we're going to do. And uh, in the upcoming two episodes, uh, I'm going to try and take Toulouse and then Montreux and hopefully get a peace with France and more of the Christian factions. That uh, would be great. 
and maybe send down some expeditions into Calaria and basically destroy this faction. Like, not take it, just overly time, destroy the settlement and then raise it to the ground. Uh, that's something I think we could do so we don't have to hold it because they're no annoying island settlements and right now island settlements are really annoying to hold because you don't have we don't have navies to be honest because I, I, the navies are quite nice if you want to help out with defending against an uh, an invasion force and if we had a navy then we could like p kill these guys off easily right now I can't unfortunately so we'll have to see where they go but so let's just end turn um, so yeah that's a bit of that summary Oh my god, I'm getting a bit annoyed now because it is getting... Oh no, I, cl I chose the wrong guy for that. Oh no, 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 no. No, a, a success? A su oh. I don't want him there at all. Um, look, oh, look at that. He's, that is, he's just being uh, buffed up by the, uh, by the king. That is just great. I I, I I'm taking a risk here, so I'm not going to do it. I'm going to put him out right away. Unfortunately, I would have loved to put him in somewhere else, but I'm not going to do it. Oh my god. Stupid, stupid, annoying, annoying unit. Oh, come on. Really? Are you like... It doesn't help if like in this position. I have no freaking idea. It would be great. But, um... I'm surprised that they actually went for the attack. I didn't expect it. I don't mind it because now I can just wipe this army out. <laughs> I had hope for a battle, but there were they were too easy. They were just too easy. That was too easy for a victory. Normally I would have fought that, but not this time. Sorry. Uh, we're going to push up towards uh, the protectors of the palace and take them out as well and now they're leaving yeah we just have to go sorry as I want a battle I can't fight that because oh I, because I don't no we, we don't have that many archers and we have more calf so I don't think we'll win that oh let's go for balanced okay that's 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 nice we'll wipe them out now all right great I had to hope for a battle but nope uh, and, a, and, a, and a navy battle but with transports. Sorry, that this is just not terrible, I would say. Who am I, right? Oh my... What? Ho, ho, what What happened here? What the fuck? Huh? What? Huh? What's this for... What? What? Hey! How on earth did you get that? What happened? They were not about to rebel. They weren't. Oh my god. Game, you screwed me very, very hardly over. Are you freaking kidding me? My Lord. Those freaking bastards. I'm going to go actually after the uh, Toulousians. Oh, and uh, we'll wipe them out. And then we'll push out Toulouse. And then we'll see what we'll do about those rebels. Yeah. Are you kidding me, Toulouse? Um, I actually won the battle. We're just going to basically wipe this army with our veteran. Like war armor, like like all of them almost have gold and separate like, except our general. Okay. Uh, did our king get killed? I have no idea. It seems like he did, but I'm not sure. But let's go and find the battle. I see you there. Let's go and get in and kill these bastards. Well, there we go. Um, uh, here we are. We're just going to throw them towards us, so that's not too bad. Uh, we'll put them in like this. Oh, no, like a, sort of like a line, and we'll put um, our pikes on the flanks. Oh my god, 30, 70 mallet defense. Oh, oh, that's nice. These guys are 60. <laughs> like, that's great because if we upgrade these guys, that is going to be interesting. Alright, we have like two of those on this flank, two of the heavy cab on this flank. No, 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 no. Just on this flank, okay? Yeah, that's great to see. Okay, you go, and we'll put these guys in here. Alright, we're going to a uh, hard group. Alright, let's go for it. Let's push forward a little bit. Why can I not just pause? I don't know why. That's just weird. Normally I can do that. Wipe out any troubles. 
And now I can't. Okay. We're up, man. Um, so they don't have any caps, so that's great. I'm just going to swamp their uh, cavalry flanks. And we're going to do that maybe already. Um, with some of the crossbows. I'm actually going to send uh, my slingers forward because, of course, uh, the archers can fire over it, the slingers can't. I'm actually going to send you over here as well to help out. The thing is, I'm not too worried now in these engagements because these guys are like tier 9 separate, so they should be able to just wipe those uh, guys out relatively quickly. In theory, I'm not sure, but might be the case. Come up, go for it. Oh my god, you idiot. Thank you for that. Thank you very much. Thank you. That's great. Oh my dear. The Granadian Knights. I have like firing actually. Yes, you are. Oh my! Oh, you! F why did you stop moving? And why did you stop moving? Yeah, asshole. If you die now, I'm going to be pissed. Oh god, fall back, slingers. Didn't do too much damage, but it's okay. I'm fine. Uh, let's actually get these guys into a formation because they are not into one. Uh, pull them away. Thing is, you don't really have to kill the most. So that's not bad, not bad. Oh, oh god. Uh, push! Push, 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 kill. Alright, that was a decent chance. I hope we kill those uh, crossbows off so we can like push against the uh, other ones. If possible. Oh, no, 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 no. You are going to hold your ground, you damn wood, dimwit. Thank you. That was my fault, though, but still. Still, 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 don't do that. Come over here, yeah. Um, let's help him out. All right, going for the attack. Pursue the general. Pursue the general. You go. Out. Really, they actually got out of that. Oh, that's lucky. That's lucky. That's a lucky one. All right, nice. Yeah, just do damage. I don't really mind so much. To be honest. Just go over here now. Oh my god, he still pulled out. Did I know that myself? I suppose I did. I'm pretty sure now. Uh, I'm actually going to not attack you because you have lost too many men, to be honest. Oh, that's not great. Oh my god. Oh yeah, that's what I said I was going to do, right? More uh, a fighting to be seen. Oh my god, this looks actually quite cool. Not bad. Not bad one bit. Can't see much else. Let's push into this. Group out. You go over here. And we're done. We're almost done. We've almost won. Oh, we didn't even kill him yet. Okay, you go over here and see if you can charge him. I think even if we... Uh, Alright, hold your fire, hold, actually you can lose like one shot on them. Just charge in, like they're really like a cool unit, they look a bit like, uh, what is it? Um, uh, they look a bit on those, uh, what are they, they look a bit on, they look a bit like conquistadors, these guys. <laughs> They, they have a little bit of the look of conquistadors, but like bit a bit more like early 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 stage or something like that. <laughs> um, but that's what I uh, like the most. But that was an easy one. Um, the balance was set so too. So let's just go to the campaign map and uh, wipe Toulouse from the face of the map. Well, there we go. Um, they should be killed. Oh my! Oh, they retreated two times. Oh, that is that that is that is sometimes the game mechanic that just don't work. Sometimes you don't have to do that, and still you have to. And now I'm pissed off the English, so that's just great. Ah, oh, boss, that's just not that's just annoying because right now I can actually replenish. Now I can get there because of that. That's just great. 
Oh, that is such a pain in the butt. Mm hmm. That is not nice. Okay, so I think we just should take Terragosa and let these guys be for now. Because Terragosa should be in a in a bad place, and they are. So good. Thank you. Uh, I think actually I will um, make uh, my son the leader of this army after the uh, after the battle. Uh, basically, I've really shit here, so let's just destroy everything except for the vineyards. Yeah, okay. Uh, that one will also go. Thank you. Alright, that's it. Um, anything else we have to do? Yeah, this one will rebel. Faster than that one. Um, look at that. We, we have like zero tax rate and still this is a bit of a problem. So, through that, we'll just go to tax it. If it doesn't help, we're not going to do it. Uh, over here, this problem province is like such a hazard. It's basically that religion difference of 25, like, eh, That's why we're going to build a mosque, to make sure that we have a little bit of Islam here, because this is basically nothing, so I suppose that's a... It is reasonable, but, like, the regional development, what regional development? Or is that because of a priest or something? I have no idea, but maybe it has. Oh, dear, I see an annoyance. Yes, they killed off my king. They did. Oh no, no he's wounded, oh thank god. I thought that because like, my king was leader of this army but now he isn't anymore. Alright then, that's good to know. Um, Well, well, well. Alright, so that was a short battle, we wiped out to lose, but next time we'll try and uh, kill them off, finally. Um, Barracks, alright, so that's the last one. Okay then, over here we're fine. Oh, this one is like the most profitable. And that's mostly because of this one. Goat pans, as well as this one with corruption decrease burned. I think also fishing docks is also good. Oh yeah. Um, that's a 4 plus, but I think if we do a fishing port instead, we'll get more food. And then we'll put in a mosque to make sure that we have a little bit more of his um, instead. Uh, but I think will be a better option to be honest. We'll do down like a mosque over here and then we'll remove this one and we'll convert it over to a, a, a fishing village to get more food in the province and then also maybe an upgrade for this one. Or might be an option also, I think those are food problems, yeah food is basically the main problem so converting it over might actually be enough to uh, sway them over and then the mosque will also help out with that little bit of extra conversion. The thing that would help is like a building that basically is like um, uh, an or um, osimis thing, how they call that, I'm not sure, something like that, and um, then, you, then the, they would basically send them over. I will actually replenish and then we'll just take this uh, settlement out and this one and then what we will do is we'll just raise them to the ground basically and we'll get the money from destroying all of that. Sort of like a plunder crusade or a sack or a raid. We're not going to take them, we'll try and um, send this army then over towards here. I think these two, these two armies can definitely deal with this problem for the moment. Um, we'll try and hold Pampolo and Toulouse, that is the idea of what they will go and do. And then hopefully we can like peace with France if possible. Do not waste time. But I don't think they want to. We'll have to see how that will progress. Uh, let's one more enter and then after that we'll see how far we are at. Well, we got the Franks. Yeah, I know uh, somebody said like don't uh, put your armies like together, try and do that. But uh, I just had to prioritize. And how right now we are uh, at uh, going to fight the Franks. So, uh, I don't think I will fight this, but I think, I'm pretty sure this guy also has like night attack, so I'm going to do the same tactic before, if I can retreat. Oh my god. That's awful. Like, that's awful. Ah, ha, ha, you failed. Thank you. Thank you very much for that. And, uh, this guy is, uh, yeah, I don't know what he's doing. Ah, well, he finally retreated backwards. 
No, an annoying priest who is going to cobbles annoyance. A lot of annoyance. Yeah, sorry mate, I won't do that. Maybe in the future I will help you out with it, but if right now they're giving me a little bit of uh, trade income. So, uh, yeah. Uh, for the next episode then, we have some good battles against the Franks, so that's not bad. Um, definitely going to find them, because we'll do it then in a night attack. To lose might Dumbo not be an option to take. That doesn't matter too much, I would say. I forgot about the spies. Well, well, doesn't matter too much. Um, but uh, yeah, let's just end turn. Well, we've got a rebellion. Uh, we have a little bit of less money. Uh, we got an uh, assassination success or something. I don't know. Uh, he has been annoyed again. Um, yeah. Oh dear. Oh dear, dear. Oh, okay, look at that. Um, yeah. yeah. Mm. You're going to go over here and take out this rebellion. You might retreat, doesn't matter. Yeah, he does. Alright, that is fine. We'll just go into uh, the settlement because then we can like go after him in the next turn. That's fine by me. Uh, we'll upgrade this one. I don't want to actually build too much more of those. Alright, that's great. I'd like to do a little bit of increasement. Not much, but some. Uh, for here, okay. So, Gosa. Basically, again, destroy most of all of this. And uh, I will send, actually, uh, this army. We're placing by the king. Thank you. I will take out his army. Uh, we'll do this in the dist. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god, that is just... I don't know, just, just, just... A bit of annoyance, I must admit. <laughs> oh, come on, really, like, all the way over there, like, he can't even go towards that right now, so that's just, that's just so annoying. And, um, yeah, I was planning on going over here, but right now we can't, really. Bambol is not basically in um, more or less a bottleneck, but oh my god, this is an out resolve, really? Pfft. Oh my god, well, then there's like one battle we'll fold for a fight for the next episode, but I'm surprised. An out resolve, really? Oh, this armor was even worse. <laughs> oh dear me. Actually, I have to fight this because this is actually a decent balance bar. Well, that's it everybody, this was Heroes of the Greeks with part number 13 of the Al Mahat Caliphate, around 40 minutes long, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, if you want to support these uh, this series and my channel, of course leave a like, it's always appreciated. And if you're new and you want to support the channel to get it higher up, uh, please leave us up, it's always appreciated of course. And uh, again, thank you for watching and I hope to see you on the next one, it was Heroes of the Greeks, and have a great day, and stay safe. Bye!